Hello and welcome back everyone. This is Angelic Fireheart and we are going to start off by looking at our Kubro. Okay, it is a female chaser. That is awesome. Okay, this pattern on her skin is very interesting. I will think about a name during this episode. While we are waiting first, let's go and claim some stuff. Okay, so we will claim the Mag Coil Helmet. And let's go ahead and claim Saren. Okay. Looks like I have to work on getting some more Warframe slots later. So there is an alert. Two alerts, actually. Okay, this one is on series, so let's go there. <coughs> Ooh, it's a hijack. These are a little bit more interesting. Don't really know how to explain them, so I'll just let you guys watch and learn. Okay, looks like I will be joining a in progress game. And looks like Montesius will be joining this game with me. I think that's how you say his name. Who knows? We never know. Okay, spawn right in next to a heavy gunner. Hmm. <clears throat> now remember, these guys are a little bit higher than the levels that we're used to, so it'll be a little bit more difficult, but I think we can power through it. <clears throat> now I see where to go. So this is what I was talking about where it steals your shield. <clears throat> Something I had forgotten to mention, however, was the fact that as you are progressing along every single second, the whatever you are hijacking at the time. This one currently is a Fomorian power core, but whatever it is that you are object that you are hijacking loses health every single second. So apparently I am stuck inside of the machine. Okay. So let's try out this fun command called slash unstuck. Okay, and now I have been shut out. Nope, there we go. <clears throat> Just working on my aim. Oh, I thought I got that one already. <clears throat> oh, never mind. I was wrong. We have not gotten a chase of Cuber yet, now that I am thinking about it. <clears throat> this will be our first ever of that breed, which means we only have one left, and it is the Huras Kubro, I believe. So basically the only, only goal 
for this mission is to take it back to where your landing craft can then attach it with a gravity beam. <clears throat> I believe the mission ends up here, not very certain. <clears throat> yep, I was right. So also, rejuvenation does affect the power core. I thought I had noticed that earlier, but I didn't want to say anything in case I was wrong. Now that I've been paying more attention with it, <clears throat> that is very clear. So that's another good point about having rejuvenation. Uh, yet again, it does not do much, but it is something. So I had lowest amount of everything, basically. But hey, we still had fun. So I think we should finish this off by getting a name for the Chasa Kubro. <clears throat> now, <clears throat> to tie it back into the game and some of the uh, the origins of the names and such, I think I will be naming it probably from a Greek goddess, other type of goddess, just a <clears throat> a goddess's name. I don't know which one yet, still kind of thinking about it. Very glad that that did not stick with us. <clears throat> I think I will name her Hera. Or... Let's name her Venus. Nah. Hera. If I named her Venus, most people would just think I'm naming her after the planet. Can't have that. Well, we got ourselves another tower to capture key, so I think that next episode, unless there is a really, really awesome alert, we will probably be doing a tower to capture or some type of void key mission. Until then, I'll see you guys later.